bad people. Being All right. English. Walter, stop fidgeting. Okay, introduce yourself. Oh, really? Yeah, nice and loud. Oh, Walter Van Dusen from Mystic Seminars. We just uh, completed our 10th year. Okay. I'm Mark, and I'm from Shockit, and I'm here with Walter, and we're in a laundromat in Portland, and I'm got, um, Walter's going to explain a bit about what Mystic is for those of you who don't know. Oh, Wedding Photography Conference. Uh, we just finished our 10th year. Uh, I do Mystic Seminars as an attendee only. So what, what would you want as an attendee? Some of the things I would want is great food for lunch. <clears throat> I also have to talk louder. Yeah. So I have to be able to be boisterous to be able to speak. Uh, strictly weddings, I do occasionally have some little, some people that don't, would not be typical uh, uh, speaker at a wedding photography conference. So 10 years. Okay, cool. So, if uh, if someone came to this year's Mystic um, and they wanted to know, uh, sorry, if someone didn't come to this year's Mystic and they wanted to know what went on, can you just tell them what what, what it was about? Who are the speakers? Oh. Name a few of them. Todd Laffler spoke for the third time. Sergio spoke for the third time. Susan Striplin spoke for the second time. Gabe McClunctic uh, from Canada spoke for the first time. He. Of course, everybody's amazing. I'm just randomly thinking because I'm still recovering from all this time. Jamie and Heather Snyder, first time speakers. They were, they were extremely fresh and uh, pleasant. The Starks, Sam Hurd. Oh, so <laughs> yeah. How much basically that? Yeah, no, that's okay. So basically, Day. yeah. So a selection of the best wedding photographers in the world have come and spoken. Um, so any highlights for you this time? The highlight was meaning, uh, the highlight for me was we had about 90% new people that never been to Mystic and about 80% of those people never heard of it, which I think is pretty cool, gives room for growth. Uh, for the first time at Mystic, we did uh, bowling. We rented a couple buses and people went to go bowling. We had a epic closing party, we had a bar crawl, and we also had, for the first time, a meet and greet. So there's a lot of firsts that we did in Portland. and also. This is our first year in Portland. We spent nine years in a place called Mystic, Connecticut. Cool. And uh, for those of the people who haven't been to Portland, what do you think of it? What do you think of it? I think it's amazing. <laughs> it, uh, Portland's known for its food, food being green. It's uh, the lot that has like the most selections of uh, beer from uh, local. What do you call them here? What are, what's it Breweries. Breweries. Yeah. So. We also had the most attendees ever. We had the biggest trade show ever. We had Nikon and Canon both lending out camera gear and also doing complimentary cleaning inspections. And every single person got their camera equipment, including Mark. Yes, yep. he's nodding his head yes. Okay, cool. So what makes Mystic different to all the other conferences out there? Well, what makes Mystic what it is, is uh, there's only one person doing it. I pick everybody. I pick the vendors, I pick the speakers, we select the menu, and most importantly, we do Mystic Guys from the perspective of as an attendee. I, also, I sit in the front row, I want to see these people, I pick these people, I pick the speakers that I want to see, and then hopefully people want to tag along. Okay, cool, and I, and I felt the vibe at Mystic, this is my first seminar, so I can't compare it, but I felt that the vibe was uh, different, everyone was super friendly and everyone wanted to network. Uh, so is that something that you've encouraged or? In the previous Mystics we were sequestered at this hotel that had nothing else around it. So the biggest challenge I had for this Mystic was being in the amazing Portland with so many things to do. So I had to create a reason for people to hang out. Uh, one, randomly thinking, one of the difference between Mystic and someplace else is that there's no uh, click. There's no click. You don't have to be invited. Everything that we have at Mystic, everyone's invited. So if you're shy, you just you're you're invited. If you're outgoing, you're invited. There's the, everybody has a pass to to meet really cool people. Okay, cool. And it's not just for wedding photographers, right? No. If you want to know about lighting, posing, business, uh, website, uh, as we both know, since you're wedding photographer, weddings encompasses everything: photojournalism, portraits. Uh, all kinds of stuff. Landscape. We had a few photographers that started as landscape photographers. 
uh, Churchill, Charlton Churchill, and also Dave Rocha. They, they also they started, I believe, in, as landscape photographers that happened to do weddings. Okay, yep, cool. So um, for Mystic 2016, uh, tell us what you know. What I do know is Two Man Studio speaking. They, they provided us a video for us to play at the end that was extremely funny. You saw that, right, Mark, or not? Yeah, it was okay. pretty much the most, it made me want to throw away my camera. It was the most amazing we photography. Heard that. I had people walking up to me that never heard of Two Man Studio, Erica and Lanny Mann. And when I first saw that video uh, at another conference, I'm like, I, always, I was always sold that they're going to be my first official speakers. So I was, I was extremely lucky that they were able to provide me that uh, ending video, which was extremely funny. So we do, we're working on the dates. We're going to be here for a few more days, uh, hopefully within a week or so from today, which is, what's today, like the 14th yeah. of January. We're going to be announcing uh, the dates, location, and a few speakers that I'm working on right now. But for sure, we have two-man studios, Landing and Era Command. Okay. Sounds awesome. So it looks like your washing's just about oh, dry. Wait one second, please. <laughs> also, uh, the glamorous, the glamorous life of a uh, host of the Mystic Seminars. We also have to do laundry. So we have uh, this wonderful shirt that I wore. We are in Portland, so you have to you have to wear plaid. So we have a little plaid. And you should always have a backup. As a wedding photographer, always have a backup. So I do have another shirt. And I also like to appreciate uh, Mark coming from all the way from Australia. He he was uh, he appeared to have a lot of fun, which I believe he did. I did. I've got a hangover. I have to and believe I, it. <laughs> well, besides that, and hopefully uh, Mark's going to come back. Hopefully in 2016, because a little bird told me he loves uh, Portland. It's true. All right. Thanks a lot, Walter. And uh, yeah, I look forward to seeing you next year. Thank you, Mark.